Hey guys. Oh, you broke it. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know how long we were holding that. I was prepared to do that for like 20 minutes. <laughs> the full, the full, okay. Not say a word. <laughs> I wasn't sure. Um, hi guys. Hello. It's been. All zero of you. Yeah. It's been a month. It, <laughs> it's been a month. Yeah. A little over a month, actually. The last mm-hmm. one was what, the 16th? 17th? Of December? Jared, do you think I keep track of these things? <sighs> I think it was the 17th. It was whatever. It was a Saturday. It was finals. Sure. I'm um, curious. Well, we're back. 16th. We're doing a show in 40 th- 42 minutes. 42 minutes. And honestly, we both forgot what it is that we do. <laughs> Jared and I are both sick. A little bit. Um, Just a little my, bit. My head is, like, pounding. So... This will be fun. We'll see if I'm capable of doing improv comedy today. It might be a little slow, but we'll figure it out. Because Jared watched as I just typed a title for this stream. It took too long. It took me way too long <laughs> to think of how words and keyboards work. Um, so, we're doing a live stream. Um, ask us questions, comments, whatever you want. Interact with us. Please, because we really had nothing planned for this, just we wanted Jared, to. fun fact, Jared has been here. Since 12.25 p.m. Damn right. And our show does not start until 3 p.m. Usually I get here at like 2. Yeah. And I thought that was early. Well, It I, is early. Yeah. I had a meeting at noon mm-hmm. on campus. Yeah. And I didn't want to walk back to my house because mm-hmm. it's in the other direction, so I just came here at 12.25. In the it doesn't take that long to walk to your house, though. Yeah, but it was, it's, it was much easier to just walk straight here and sit here and do stuff instead of walking to Jared, my house. I've walked to your house. It takes like 10 minutes at I, most. I'm not talking about time. I'm just lazy. <laughs> I, I mean, what I did here was what I would be doing at my house, which is just sitting around yeah. hanging out on my phone, so. I'm gonna be that guy. You gonna watch the stream? I'm gonna watch the stream. Yes. While we're streaming. While we're streaming. Make it look like there's more than just Tim Godomsky watching us. Yep. Thank you, Tim, for tuning in. I'm going to get really thrown off by the delay. That's cool. Oh, goodness. (laughs) Oh, it's a good, like, few seconds. Yeah. So, Tim Godomsky, leaving the only comment. Really appreciate it, Tim. No. No. (laughs) Good comment. Um, Again... We have nothing planned for this, so it's whatever you guys want to do. We can't do anything if you don't. <laughs> I don't like because I, I don't want to ask Jared questions because then we'll have nothing to talk about over during the show. Yeah. Um, oh, because we don't have a guest this week. Oh yeah, if, no. If anyone watching saw the post that yeah. we made like the other day, we don't have a guest. We don't have a guest. That's on purpose, though. Yeah. Um, because Get, getting used to the new cause, time. Yeah, because we have an extra half hour to kill with this show now. And, and I mean kill, because it's time we never get back. Yeah. Um, It'll be fun. So no guests, just to get accustomed to the new schedule. More music. So this is definitely going to be a very experimental episode. Mm-hmm. We'll see what happens. Hey, we have two viewers. Second viewer, make yourself known. Who I, are you? I think it's you. <laughs> <laughs> You're streaming it on That's... your laptop. Oh, well, now we have now, three, now we so have it's three. definitely more than me. Okay, so there's someone else. Someone. If, if, whoever this uh, third person is, if uh, you have... Our uh, live streams just turn into us begging people to say something. Yeah, oh, Liam. 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 We always have the same people. <laughs> it's okay. It's Those are the people who really care. We have a no and a yo. <laughs> um, Liam, if you have any questions for us, or Tim, if you have any questions for us, we're, we're looking for something to talk about. So, Jared, what yeah. are your thoughts on Mandy Patinkin? Oh, my God. Uh, he... I don't I don't even remember half the things that he was in. Oh, he was in The Princess Bride. He was in The Princess Bride, yeah. I was mainly upset. So, no one's going to understand what we're talking about, nope. except for the people that were there. Um, so, last night, I was at Jared's house. Mm-hmm. And we were, for some reason, we were discussing Evita and how the casts of Evita are always white. <laughs> <laughs> for some reason despite being a not white show yeah it's about people in Argentina and I got really upset that Mandy Patinkin played Che Guevara in <laughs> Evita because he's a white man and the first like one of the first people appropriate to play the role was Ricky Martin on Broadway a few years ago yeah 
And then the conversation just went downhill from there. It just turned into looking through every, every Broadway role, actors. every role Mandy Patinkin has ever played. Which uh, Liam pointed out includes Criminal Minds. Criminal Minds. He was on an episode of Criminal Minds. Nope. Tim Sheehan's watching. Um, favorite state shape. Oh goodness. What's your favorite state shape, Jared? Oh. Um. That's a hard question. Thank you. This is good. This is a good question. Which one's the one that's just a square? Like half the ones that are in like the Midwest. In the Midwest, right? There's more than one. Yeah. I'm not a. I'm not a uh, let's, geography. Let's pull up a. a, a picture. We're gonna pull up a map of the United States now, guys. Just so we can remember what shapes are there. <laughs> map of the USA. We're gonna. We're really del- diving deep. I can't think. Okay. Oh my goodness. No, I want, I want to full screen this. What portrait mode? Your portrait mode. It was portrait. Mode. Okay. Let's All right. See. Let's really get into this. Colorado is the square. Or so what's Wyoming? Wyoming. <laughs> um, I'm gonna say my favorite state shape. You know, I've, I've I'm that. really liking Idaho. Why? I don't know. It's just, it's different. Okay, I can see that. My answer is Idaho. I'm torn, I'm torn between Michigan and Louisiana. Michigan's a good one. Michigan looks... It's like separated. Too. Yeah, it looks like a glove, and then it's not even connected to each other. Um, so I don't know why that half. part of Michigan is just... Why I don't know why isn't that just an extension of Wisconsin? I, don't I like that Jared's home state is too small to even fit the name. The name in yeah. the thing. Mine isn't. You know, shush. And then Louisiana kind of just looks like a person's foot without a boot on. Where's Louisiana? Right down there. Oh yeah. Like with the islands kind of, or the. For Pacific. some reason, I always thought Louisiana was on the other side of Texas, but it's not. It's not. <laughs> no. I always think it's the New Mexico. I switch them. Oh, that's interesting. Well, Louisiana is along the coastline. New Mexico's not. Yeah. But yeah, those are. That is, oh, oh favorite so. dinosaur. There are too many. Oh, um. Well, it depends on what we're going for. Are we? Going I just for... actually hit my head. That hurt. <laughs> are we going for lethality, like the most dangerous? No, dinosaur? just which one's your favorite? Oh, hi, hi Pepper. Hi, Pepper. Um, ask us questions. Um, favorite dinosaur. <sighs> it's so hard. It is. Why is that? Okay, an alarm just went off for some reason. Um, probably to remind you to go to the radio station. Oh, that's probably it, actually. Um, oh gosh. Um. Honestly, I'm I, gonna go Triceratops. It's understandable. I'm torn between the um, Mesialoth- Mesialothosaurus because it is pretty much a gigantic like. Uh, water iguana i don't even know what that is it's pretty much a loch ness monster a depressed iguana no no uh, it's pretty much a really big form of the loch ness monster um or have to go with the comsognathus because they are the size of chickens <laughs> mm-hmm. um and are scavengers and are really good Whoa, at jumping we have former guest aaron townsend watching now oh wow aaron Ask us questions pepper ask us questions yeah ask us a question those are good questions though tim liam Oh, no, Tim didn't ask us a question. Liam, Gadams- Tim oh, Tim Gadomsky. Yeah. Tim Sheehan, step up. Ask us questions. Yes, we know Wyoming is very square. And Matt! Matt. Hey, Matt. Oh. It's so good. Every, so time I, every time I see Matt, I'm like, I love Matt. What are we talking about, Aaron? He, no, he said, what are we taking about? Taking let's, about? Let's, um, let's be clear here. He asked us, what are we taking about? Well, I usually take my phone about with me. It's kind of important to yeah. my daily life. I take pretty much anywhere I go, I take my phone... My wallet, my keys. Wallets are important. Usually my backpack, because I'll put some some of the things in my backpack. Hello, Matt. Hello, Matt. He said said hi. All right. I guess we should answer, what are we talking about? Nothing. (laughs) We're talking about questions. We're talking about waiting for people to ask us questions. Because that's what we're looking for. (laughs) Yeah, Aaron, we know exactly what you meant. You meant, what are we taking about? (laughs) (laughs) Uh, You know, we wanted to just go live for a little bit. I do also take my glasses. Ooh. Pretty much everywhere I go. Same. Unless it's a day where I wear contacts, which is rare. Rare. I can't wear but contacts. I, but I do it. You can't? No, I, I can't. Why? I tried. Like, I don't know. Fre- like, freshman year around then, I tried contacts, mm-hmm. and, like, I was able to, like, like, it took me a few weeks to get used to putting them in and stuff. 
You see the what? paragraph Jim just left us? All right. There's a no, finish your, sto- finish your story. Okay. So, um, so, we'll so, so I was able, I was able to like, like put the contacts in and everything, but then I started noticing that like, uh, sometimes when I would blink, they would just kind of pop out. Okay. Only one of them was only like the left eye. The right one was okay. fine, but the left eye just kept popping out. And so like, I tried a bunch of different contact sizes or mm-hmm. shapes or uh, kind of like, uh, correcting for like astigmatism that I technically didn't have, but apparently I did cause it wasn't working. And I just... My eye doctor and I couldn't find mm-hmm. anything that worked. All right. And so it was either stick with glasses or have good vision in one eye, which is really bad for All me. All right. Um, before we get to Tim's, um, yes, Aaron, I do like the show The Good Place. I think it's very funny. Um, that's it. Okay. So, All right. In. There is a runaway trolley. Bar- I like that it's a trolley. Um, barreling down the... Ra- Why isn't it just a train? There's a runaway trolley barreling down the railway tracks. Ahead on the tracks, there are five people tied up and unable to move. Oh, no. The trolley is headed straight for them. You are standing some distance off in the train yard next to a lever. If you pull this lever, the trolley will switch to a different set of tracks. However, you notice that there is one person tied up on the side track. You have two options. Do nothing, and the trolley kills the five people on the main track. Pull the lever, diverting the trolley onto the side track where it will kill one person. What is the most ethical choice? Well, you didn't really give us enough information. Do we know the people who are tied down on the track? Mm-hmm. I mean, if... if also... Uh, do trolleys go down railway tracks? Don't they have their own special tracks through, like, cities? Yeah, a trolley would be in the city. I wish someone luck trying to tie someone to a trolley track. Because it's usually, it's like a divot in the ground. It is, yeah. That, oh, like, and Tim, let us so know to that. answer your question, you can't tie someone to a trolley track. So Boom. this question does not work. Okay, so... Tim, oh no, the tied up people are very diverse. They're very diverse. <laughs> they are random strangers that we do not know. Um, I'm sorry, Matt, that your brain is starting to hurt from this. But, I mean... If, 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 if all else being equal, if we know nothing about... I'm going to assume... I'm going to change it to a train, just so this question yeah, makes, yeah, sense, makes sense. And we could answer it. Tim? Honestly, if if everybody... If we don't know anybody... Liam, we can't roll them out of the way. They're all tied to the track. Well, I mean, I mean, if 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 they're tied to trolley tracks, we probably could roll them out of the we way. We could, because they're not tied to anything. Because they're not tied to Tim, anything. Tim, you say we're going for a realistic modern theme. Trolleys have been around for a very long time. <laughs> so have trains. Trains still exist in 2018. I took one just the other day. Aaron, that's a good question. I took two just the other day. With eth- which ethics are we talking? Which ethics... I are we going, like, moral ethics? Are we going societal ethics? I don't know. Oh, my goodness. Yes, Tim, trolleys do exist. Trolleys do but... exist, but you can't tie people to a trolley track. They're That's, indented. They're, it's an indent in the ground. Tim. Okay. I don't... He's, so, he's listening okay. to everything else we're saying, but not the one point that <laughs> makes this entire question not make any okay, sense. Okay, so more m- moral ethics... Mm-hmm. Which sh- do we do nothing and kill five people, uh-huh. or do we do something and kill one? Person? I don't get why this is my responsibility. Well, there's that. See, that's that's part of the thing. Because, but since you are not doing something, you are you not doing something is resulting in the death of. Tim said he copied this from Wikipedia. What Wikipedia page did you get this from? Yeah, you are being slandered too. Well, yeah, but it's, it's come up with a good conversation. So while we are mad at you, Tim, oh you're doing a great God. job. I'm always really mad proud. at Tim. Well, that's fair. I can't stand it. <laughs> right, Pepper? Yeah. Pe- he t- I don't know important. if she's still watching. I hope so. Who knows? We'll find out. Um, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Take that, Tim. Cite your sources. <laughs> Said Aaron. <laughs> um, Everyone is on our side. I love this. Um, um, okay. We'll change it to a train just so we can answer the question. Okay. So five people tied to one track, one tied to the other. Do They're we... all very diverse. We don't know who they are. Mm-hmm. Um, on one hand... Why can't the person driving the train mo- make this decision? They can stop the... Well, it depends on how fast they're going and how far There's away no they information are. about how fast they're going or how well, it's far just, away It's just this barreling down barreling the track. Barreling down. A barrel doesn't necessarily move fast. Fair enough. I've I... seen barrels not move at all. I mean, I think they're going for the... Uh, Usually, the, when the... I see a barrel, it's not moving. That's a good point. Um, well... I think the question is assuming a basis of knowledge unrightfully so. <laughs> Aaron said the people have died by now. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good point. Aaron, we don't know that. We don't know how fast this trolley or train is going. 
I'll say if 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 the if the if the trolley slash train uh, conductor knows anything about what they're doing, they would stop the train. Hopefully, Let trolley problem. Wikipedia. All right. Okay. I'm just gonna add some things to this hypothetical. The train is going ninety miles an hour. Really fast. Yes. Really fast. Um, the conductor taking a nap. He it was going real slow. He dropped a rock on like the pedal. I'm gonna say it's a pedal. I don't okay. know how trains work. Uh, I think it's a lever, but sure. He did something. He put a bungee cord Broke on it. there, and then he jumped out. Yeah. There's no one so driving. It's a, so it's a runaway. It's a runaway train. It's a runaway train. Um. Now they're arguing about citations. It's glorious. Thank you, Aaron. This is more of an APA. <laughs> oh man, why is everyone that watches our show or listens to our show funnier than we are? Um, you guys should do the show. What are we doing? Okay, so it's a runaway train going really, really fast. Okay, and, and it's we, a train, definitely. It's definitely a train. We're changing that. Um, and there are five people on the straightaway track. The train cannot go less than ninety miles an hour, otherwise it explodes. We're not trying to slow it down. Not anymore. We just have to make a moral decision here. Or an ethical decision. Um, <laughs> oh. And giving, giving the fact that we don't know anybody, our inaction will result in the death of five people. We'll probably or, weigh in our conscience. Or our decision or will person. be the direct death of another. Well, it's a decision either way. Exactly. <clears throat> Speed was a good movie. Speed was an okay movie. <laughs> um, honestly, I'm going to have to go with change the lever and run over the one person because even if because i would I, I personally would feel like my inaction my inability to choose would be my choice of killing those five people and i'd rather only have one on my conscience than five i i know some people would be like nah bra if you don't do anything then it's not your responsibility but honestly yes aaron that's definitely jared's an active killer confirmed um tim we just established that no one is conducting the train they jumped out and I Although, doubt, and I guarantee, if Denzel Washington and Chris Pine were genuinely conducting a train, they would have just stopped the train. Yeah, I, I trust them. With they would have life. sacrificed their own lives. They would have jumped in front of the train to stop the train. That's not how it worked, but they would have done it. And I think they could have done it. Boom. Um, thank you, Aaron, for your support. Prove to me that Chris Pine can't stop a train. <laughs> Prove it. What would you do, Michael? Because um, apparently Aaron... Oh, the train is now unstoppable. Okay. Well, uh, yeah. If it's like a train in GTA 5, then yeah. Yeah, no, that makes sense. But now, um, now knowing that, whatever decision you make, Aaron will call you an active killer. Jared is the Zodiac <laughs> Killer confirmed 2018. Awesome. Good um, to know. Um, I will... I, I'm going to have to agree with you. Mm-hmm. Switch it to the one person. Especially because the five people are a very diverse group of people. I'm going to establish in this hypothetical that the one person is Tim Sheehan. Ooh, ouch. That, that... And I'm still switching it to Tim. Oh. I just, okay. Good to know. Take that into consideration, guys. If you don't change it, you're a passive killer. <laughs> because you're leaving Tim? <laughs> I think I would just... <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna switch it to the one person. Yeah, that's what I would. That's, I think that's what I would do. I think anyone, if anyone ever genuinely finds themselves in this situation, first off, wow, how did you find yourself in this situation? Also, I would, I would be, I would be more concerned finding the person who tied them up. Yeah, also, how long have those people been tied there that no one has just been like, yeah. I'm gonna untie you? Yeah, like. How far away is the train? Would I have time to untie the one person and then run back to the lever? Like, yeah, the levers. Yeah, could I switch it to the one person and then untie them? Or, I mean, depending on how far away, you might want to untie them then switch it. it. Depends on how close they are to the switch. I mean, either way. Either way, if it works, it works. I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch it to the one, mm -hmm. then try to untie them. Mm -hmm. If I can't do it in time, oops, one person dies. Because like, if I untie the one person. But then don't switch it in time. If you don't have time. Then five people usually, die. Usually the levers are pretty close, though. Yeah. They're maybe, they're maybe like less than ten feet away because a conductor needs to be able to change Also, it. Is, there, is there no one else around that I couldn't be like, hey, you switch it. They're all tied up. There's no one else nearby? Uh, according to... Why am I just hanging around these train tracks? Especially near a lever. Like, that's really sketchy. What if, what if, usually we, the lever, what if we are the ones who tied them up? Yeah, usually the lever is not, like, in a place, like, near the p public. It's, like, in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, but what if we are the ones who tied them up in the first place? I think that's the only reason why I would be out there. 
So if that's the case, if we're going <coughs> that, if we're going with a little character development that we are the ones who tied them in the first place, we must have done it for a reason. Therefore, we wouldn't change it because we're playing some sort of saw type game. Yeah. So like, if if we are the bad guys, then we would want to create as much mayhem as possible. Well, Tim, I can't cut the rope. You didn't establish that I have anything I could use to cut a rope. I don't know. This is a also, bad question. Also, also, you said you wanted to be modern to 2018. Are there still levers that change divergence, yeah. or is it all done like electronically now? Because if it's done electronically, well then I mean, one... it's done electronically, but I'm pretty sure there are still levers, like in case probably fails. In ca in, yeah, yeah, in case it doesn't, the electronics don't oh, work. Yeah, that's true. There's always a man. There's always a manual way to do manual, things. Yeah. It's like how elevators are, the 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 hip thing, but there's still stairs. <laughs> they are stairs have not gone out of fashion. Oh yay, we graduated. To you, Talderianism. Shush, Aaron. We graduated. Um. Oh, Amanda Grillo, another former guest. Amanda, feel free to ask us a question. Probably going to be wrapping up in like ten minutes or so. Yeah, when it probably. Gets close. So well, so we yeah, that's true. Unless they want to watch us do the mic check, but. I don't think they do. Yeah, no, I wouldn't think so. Why didn't we do that already? <laughs> I don't know. We've I've been, been here. I've for been a here while. since twelve twenty-five. <laughs> I could have. I could have done a mic check. But yeah, Tim Gadomski, Why are they just on the street? Because <laughs> Tim said this is in the middle of a major city. Because trolleys. So, well, if it's a train in the middle of a major city, we're talking. This is would... either like New York. Um, if we're above ground, mm -hmm. we're, uh, it's some places in New York, sometimes yeah. the train goes above ground, depending on where you are. Oh, um, yeah, also depending on what the train is for, there are a lot of... Could be Boston. It, it could just be an intersection in any city yeah. where, the, where the train tracks cross a, a normal driving road. In which case, why are there no other cars on the road? I know! And Someone... why, why, why would there be a, a diversion on a driveway? On a roadway. That doesn't make any sense. That'd be really bad planning on everybody's part. Yeah, and also Gudamthi has a good question. Is the lever open to the public? You would think they'd have it, like, locked so that, like, only professional could get in. Yeah. Hi, Amanda. Tim, what we're saying here is, that was a terrible question. Well, and you, you should feel... You. you should... No, I don't thank him. Um, we're not friends anymore. Oh. Well, it's I'm... a government setup. <laughs> I feel like that question just hasn't been properly is, adapted. To well, the Aaron, the government can't set us up right now because they're shut down, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. It's One... not the actual show. We can get political. <laughs> <laughs> we can get political on the actual show, too. We, just we try can. Not to. We just don't want to. We don't want to talk about that. I'm amazed we haven't, really. <laughs> we did once or twice, but we kind of nipped that in the butt real quick. Yeah. Oh, why is there a wow react for making a political I think joke? it's mainly... I think we mainly don't get political because neither of us can do a good Donald Trump impression. That's true. I mean, I don't know that you can't. I'm assuming um, you can't. I can't. I'm gonna T guess you can't. Tim, why are you so sad? Tim's really sad. <laughs> Probably because we just... <laughs> we, we just, just said we were gonna kill animal. him, and then I... Just, I broke up with Tim. <laughs> oh, no. Because me and Tim are about as close to dating without dating as you can get. Yeah. Tim's basically my boyfriend. I could believe that. He's not. Sorry, Pepper. That, okay, yeah, we figured that out, Tim. You're a little slow to it. If you weren't spamming the sad button, you could have, you know, told us that sooner. <laughs> there, is, there is a delay. There is a delay. Oh, thank you, Tim. He now loves us. <laughs> what, were those hearts, Tim, as well? Yeah, it looked oh like it. God. Uh, oh goodness! Why do these always just devolve? I don't know, but I feel like I feel nonsense. like it's I feel like it's uh, pretty apt for what this show is going to be today. Whoa, those weren't for you. Oh, okay. They were just for me. Okay, I'm sorry, Tim. Uh, does anybody else have any questions? Oh my God, there's still people watching this. I'm so sorry. Why are you watching this? The old job oh, in the show. Oh, is that, oh, Tim, you is jerk. Is that your, your D&D &D stuff? Yeah. yeah. Last semester, Tim and I were in a campaign, and I was a human ranger, he was a half-orc barbarian, and he mm -hmm. was going to throw a javelin at this invisible kind of dude that was just, like, hardcore, like, trolling us the entire time. Yeah. It's really frustrating. And mm -hmm. he went to throw it, and he literally just like he rolled a natural one so like uh -huh. his character just didn't let go and it followed through yeah. and it swung around and stabbed me in the shoulder mm -hmm. and we were level one so i only had like eight hit points and that took out like seven hit points so i was i was almost knocked unconscious Jared, from him messing i will up. point out aaron sent you some hearts oh thank you Aaron. And amanda grillo is watching because of friendship and she, amanda just continues to prove why she is a good friend. That is true. You are a great friend. 
Anyone Hello. who's friends with her can confirm. Hello, Hayden. You Hello. joined a really interesting time. Um, <laughs> have fun. You missed a lot. Go. You, you'll figure. You'll figure out a, a vague kind of synopsis of what's been going on by going through the chat, because that's pretty much where we what we've been talking about. Um, Tim was there for the invisible. He was. Man. Yeah, Godomsky was also in that campaign. Um, I wasn't. Oh, hi, Bree. Bree. Hi, Bree. Oh, so was Liam. Liam was also in that campaign. Hi, Bree. Hi, Whoa. Bree. There's hype in the chat for Bree. Oh my god. We love you, Bree. We miss you. Come back. Bree, ask us a question. <laughs> Please, we are we're we're grasping at straws here. Greeting from Beauty and the Beast. Oh my god, uh, right. Bree's in Beauty oh, and the Beast right oh, now. Oh, today is your double header, isn't it? Oh, it's t well, today's Saturday, so yeah. Yeah. Break a leg, Bree. Good luck. I hope this is in between shows and not during a show. If it's during I, a show, good luck. I hope. What about Zach Fontanez? Yeah. Is Zach Fontanez watching this right now? I don't know. His name didn't pop up. No, it didn't. Oh my god. Did we miss him? No, I don't know. How did I miss him? I can't miss Zach Fontanez <laughs> twice. Zach Fontanez, if you're watching this, um, like two days ago, I saw you on campus. Yay. And, um... Hi, Cookie. Uh, oh, Zach was in the oh, group. Oh, okay. Zach was in the D&D well, group at the he's time. he's not watching. Then I'm no. gonna not... I'm not gonna finish the story. Yeah. Also, Cookie just joined in and she was the DM for that campaign. Hi, Ariana. Ariana! Um, your former stage wife. That is true. Um, and I'm just gonna say it, future guest on the show. That is true. We won't tell you when, but she not gonna tell you when. But Ariana is me. scheduled to come on the show. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure we can't tell them when because we don't know when. I don't remember. We had this. Well, we had the schedule down somewhere. Uh, but Tim, yeah, um, he he was a really old wizard. Mm -hmm. uh, he's been practicing magic for about a week, and in the, <laughs> and in the first session, uh, he ended up shatting himself twice. To the point where he had to steal someone's, like, a, a skirt from somebody who lived <laughs> in the town and was wearing that instead. <laughs> it was... Oh, sorry, Aaron, we spoiled it for you. Um, <laughs> Ariana's gonna be a guest. Yep. Um, she told me... Did she tell you about this? Oh, no, she told me at rehearsal for the Trojan Woman the other day. Yeah. Um, she had a nightmare. Oh, no. And the nightmare was coming on this show. <laughs> <laughs> Josh Lodge, former guest, first guest... That is true. He was the first guest. Ariana, hopefully your um, hopefully your nightmare doesn't come true. But knowing us, it um, probably will. I I had a lot of people there that had been on the show assure her that it's really not that bad. Yeah. Um, we'll only harass you a little bit. Oh, it's my mom. Hi. My mom's watching. Right, right. In time. We're going to be signing off soon. We can stay on a little we can longer. Stay for a little bit longer. Mom, we're only going to stay on if you ask us a question. Yeah. If you don't ask us a question, we're signing off right now. Um. Oh, wow. wow. So apparently Ariana did very poorly on the show and we hated oh, her. Oh my goodness. I mean, we do already hate Ariana. Hi, Michael's mom. We already hate Ariana, but like... I mean, she was she was an okay stage wife. She was cold a lot. <laughs> oh, how am I feeling? Good <laughs> question, Mom. You missed the beginning. Um, me and Jared are both sick, and I, I woke up today feeling far worse than I have felt the past few days. Um, I'm... I'm at, yay. So, yeah. So I'm at like 93, 94%. Sick? No, or, healthy. Or healthy. I'm at like three percent healthy. healthy. Oh no! Well, okay, that we everyone's saying hi to my mom. <laughs> she's she's the new star of the show. Um, we'll have her on as a guest eventually. Yeah. Oh, Josh, <laughs> say hi to my mom. I have chicken soup. Uh, I don't want chicken soup. What are my feelings on Vitas? Good job, Bree. Um, Vitas is a glorious, human easily being. the greatest songwriter of all time. Ariana, say hi to my mom. <laughs> 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 she said hi to everyone back, <laughs> but she only said hi to Josh. That is true. No one else. I I, I love you people. You're great. Um, my feelings on Vitas. Vitas is amazing. Wonton soup is awesome. Really I'm, I'm much more happily eat wonton soup mm -hmm. than chicken soup. We should get Chinese. Oh my god! Everyone wants to say hi to my mom. <laughs> I'm just trying to explain my feelings on Vitas. <laughs> he he. So is... Josh gets a personal shout out. Then Every, just give everyone else. That's okay. We we all know that Josh is more important than all of us. That's true. He was the first guest. He was the first guest. Um, Vitas. <laughs> so for those of you who don't know, Vitas wrote an incredible. Peter. Peter. Vitas wrote an. <laughs> Mommy Michael. No. <laughs> Vitas wrote an amazing song called Seventh Element. Um, Jared, can we sing it for them right now? Oh gosh. Do you want to pull it up? Um, no. Okay. We're just gonna. It go. It goes a little bit like this. <laughs> And that does that first pretty much it. And then he sings in a foreign language that I don't know. Yeah, probably Russian because he's a I Russian think it's, superstar. Is it, is it Russian? Yeah, I'm pretty uh, sure. I don't know. Um, oh yes, you'll be a guest. Your mom, your mom has to come. Wow, 
Bree gets a shout out. Aaron gets a shout out from my mom. Oh man. Oh, um, I would. Uh, yes, Matt. It was yes, Matt the Russian, Russian dude. dude. Yeah. Um, that's exactly what we're talking about. Um, Michael's mom. This is the most active our chat has ever been. I can't even handle it. Jacob! Um, Michael's mom, we would love to have you a guest on the show, although you will have to technically um, either become a faculty member or... Uh, we can always have student. her phone in. That is true. We can always have her phone in. Why would why would we ban Blair me? Blair, I love Blair me. Also, Bree wants to uh, have a Vitas the Musical. And Vitas the Musical. I, I, I agree. That would be hilarious. Well... Mom, I don't know why we would Skype you in, considering this is an audio-based <laughs> you, you, show. I'm sure we could figure out how. You could probably just like. Call. I know there's. I know there's, there's a there's way. A call feature. There here. is a way. I don't know how it works. We'll yeah, figure we, it out. We'll figure it out. We have a bunch of people we can talk to, um, and so we could definitely find a way to get you phoned in. It'd mm-hmm. be a lot of fun. It'll be great. It would be the first non-student guest. That'll be it. That'll be a good one. Where yeah. We just talked to my mom. For an hour and a half. Well, we won't do that the whole time. I don't think we'll make her do improv. Yeah, no. We won't, she wants to. We won't put her through that. I mean, if you want to do improv, we can do My that. mom f- likes to think she's really funny. Oh, we're going to say... She'll be she'll be a secondary guest on Ariana's okay. show. How about that? Yeah. We're going we're gonna to say it right now. The episode with Ariana, my mom will also be a guest. Also, Josh... I'm saying it right now. J- Josh, just, uh, Josh just put a... He just sent a YouTube link. I'm not going to click it. I'm assuming it's, it's probably, probably Vitas. probably Vitas, but um, Josh, if you can let us know what it is... I'll watch it later. Yeah, no matter what it, it is, I will watch it later. All right, it's confirmed. Wow, they're both very excited for it. Whenever, whenever, whenever Ariana, Ariana comes show. on, my mother will call in, and we're gonna talk to her. We're gonna we'll interview both of them we'll at the same time. Both of them. My mom can interview Ariana. Ariana can interview my mom. Um, Josh, we don't really take song requests. We, but you can try. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> We might take song requests. I don't know. Oh, oh it's oh. two forty nine. Yeah, we should probably. Go. We should probably start wrapping this up. Oh, Nick. Nick Decker. <laughs> we were literally just about to sign off. We can't Nick sign off when Nick Decker joins. Uh, um, why are so many people watching this? I don't know, but I'm okay with it. I'm not going to question it. Um, okay. All right. Well, so, don't ask the questions now. Yeah, don't ask write the them down so you don't forget them. So we'll have them interview each other and we'll yeah. just leave. It'll, yeah, we won't even. We'll turn our mics off. It. it, it no, like we'll just, we'll leave them on. We'll just straight up leave. We'll leave and just let Ariana them talk. and like mom will be the hosts of the show. We'll let them talk as long. We won't even stop them at an hour and a half. Yeah. Like we'll just let them. No keep one. On. No one else. No one else has a show on Saturday. As far as we know. As far as we know. Um. Does everyone like my haircut? Oh, yeah, I think Jared, okay. Jared, do you like my haircut? Yeah. Okay. I mean, you have a you have a little bit of a like a, a, like I a do. little sticky outy bit. Well, cuz I was I wearing was, that was just cut a little too short. Well, it was also just because I was wearing a hat. Okay, that would And do. my hair was wet. But yeah, no, I like it. I like my haircut, and that's so, what that's all that matters. Right, so do you want to ask I like like it. one more question? Um, do one we, more, we one don't more. Ha- we don't have any more questions. I know. Well, well if you say All right, the next person to get a question in will be the last question. Even if there's an amazing question after that, we're not going to answer it. Only, only the next, only the next Guys, question get, that pops up. Get your questions in. This is unless you know. nobody asks a question, in which case we have to just leave this on until somebody asks a question. Yep. You could really screw us over right you now. You really could. Josh, stop sending YouTube links. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a question. That's a song request. Maybe. Do I like dogs? Do we like dogs? <laughs> <laughs> Do we like dogs? I, for one, love dogs. I love dogs. They're the best. Um, the yeah. The the the. I, I prefer bigger dogs because I'm scared if I ever get a small dog, I'll accidentally trip over them. Um, it's a legitimate fear of mine. So, like, an Amaskan Malamute or, like, a Samoed, just big, fluffy ones, those are my favorite. I love big dogs, but I also like little dogs. I have I have several little dogs. I mean, I have big dogs. No, I have big dogs. I don't have, I have any a, dogs. I have a big dog. My girlfriend has a dog. We don't really know what kind of dog she is, but she's she loves scratches and hates toys that make sound. It's really interesting. Oh man, Jacob wants us to discuss the OJ the OJ case. We can, we can't, and, and Aaron wants us to talk about the state of existence. Guys, it's too bad. It's too Maybe bad. we'll talk about it on the actual show. We don't know. We definitely could. So, so we're gonna wrap this up because yeah. we have to go live in nine minutes. Yeah, and we haven't done sound check or anything. Yeah, it won't take that long. So but um, have fun. thanks. Thanks for actually tuning in, guys, and asking us questions. This, this is actually better this went a lot better than it usually does. This might be better than the actual show, guys. Yeah, probably. <laughs> um, so thank you for watching. And and we hope you join us in nine minutes on WNHU2 for our show. So, yeah. Um, See you soon. Ah! <laughs> Bye. That wasn't supposed to happen. Bye.